Well, good morning and welcome to another photography adventure. As you can see, I am out and about here nice and early on a crisp, frosty, snowy morning in the Scottish borders. This morning I am heading up one of the Eildon Hills, which are three sort of iconic hills here in the borders. Normally these are the hills which I am photographing from other areas around the borders, but today, for sunrise, I thought, Let's head up to the top and see what competitions we can grab from up there. Especially because yesterday there was some fresh snowfall, nice frosty night last night, which should give us some nice features in the landscape. I always find that in the winter, that the landscape around November, December, January, February can become very bland and featureless without some nice frost and snow. And that's exactly what we've got here this morning. I'm gonna head up to the top and see what compositions we can find. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I have made it to the top of the North Eildon here. It is 40, 50 minutes, still 50 minutes, five zero minutes until sunrise. What an absolutely stunning morning it is, as you can see. My initial thoughts up here this morning are that I might not shoot from the actual summit itself. I think I will drop down a little bit and see if I can find a composition a little bit closer to the two over at Yildon Hills. Another one of my initial thoughts is that Ruber's Law, which you would have remembered from a vlog two vlogs ago now, when we hiked up there with my friend Callum for sunrise, it is actually a tiny hill away in the distance here, you won't see it on the GoPro but I do notice that there is some nice fog lingering around the base of Rupert's Law. So I might be missing an inversion and one of the things I did think about doing this morning typically was going back up Rupert's Law to get the same shots with the snow. But maybe I can do that tomorrow and maybe conditions will be even better. There is also some cloud hanging around on the eastern horizon which might stop us getting that nice early morning light which is kind of what I'm relying on here for this shot to light up the side of the hills. I think I'm going to have a cup of coffee up here just now and then head back down and see if I can find a composition. Woo. Well, that's me had my coffee for this morning and now it's time to get to work. So I'm going to head back down the hill just behind me here. As I said before, the snow turns what would normally be quite a brown barren foreground into something far more interesting. Um, already seeing some of the grass here just with the snow crisping over the top which would normally be a very boring foreground shot but I can actually use it now to really add that sense of cold and rawness to the images. Okay I'm going to head down here a little bit and see if I can find some compositions as we go. Well after some frantic running around the hill like a feral Scottish animal. I've managed to find an area where I think I'm going to be quite happy to shoot from just now. Um, I've gone for, oh there's some people walking up this Eildon behind me in the middle here. I'm going for a wide shot. I'm shooting at 16 mils. That is so that I can still capture quite a lot of sky and I also want to try and accentuate all this um, texture and detail in the, in the bushes in front of me. Wow, we have some beautiful colour to this side. We have some beautiful colour on this side. We just don't yet have the beautiful colour on this side, uh, which is typical, of course. But we will hope that this is going to start to catch some beautiful light just now. The sun should come up above those clouds in the next 15, 20 minutes. So I'm going to fine tune this composition now and then come back to you guys with hopefully some beautiful light and some beautiful images. Looks like we're about to get that direct sunlight that I've been waiting for. It should cast some beautiful light onto the sides of the hills here. Here comes the sunshine now. Time to get shooting. Okay, woohoo, let's go.
Well, what a beautiful, beautiful morning this has turned out to be. I feel like I'm in Narnia. It's so, so, so beautiful. Perfect winter wonderland. I think I've got some beautiful shots to show you, some beautiful drone videos as well. Um, now it's time to head back to the car, which is, to get back to the car, I come down this path along the front of here, back in between these two hills and the car is down in the distance. Wow, what a morning, what a morning. I shall see you on the next adventure. Okay, don't go anywhere just yet as I've got one more image to share with you from the area near where I parked my car. Woo!